Hi, I'm Paul Toll from PaulToll.com, and I'm going to show you tonight that Rich Razor and Bounty works for the Mac. First of all, some website, all the cool stuff, lots of games, DOS, Amiga, MSX games, but especially Windows games, and I'm going to focus at the moment on Rich Razor and Bounty. You can go on several ways to the game page using the here button from the blog or the Mac Game Ports uh, link up here. On the new sites, it will be Game Ports, and then you can go to uh, Go to strategy, no, racing, and then rich razor and bound it. If you don't own the game yet, you can get it from uh, Gamesgate using the link up here. If you purchase it up here, you get a serial which you can add in Steam. Then, you of course, you also need the wrapper which you can download from uh, here. Download, click on save. Save the file on the on the test uh, on your downloads folder, and then um, you can uh, can open it. Downloads. Mm. Where did it put it? Ah, yeah. Well, they can open it. Right, double click, click agree. Click skip. Then you can move the wrapper to the desktop like this. Just copy it up here. Then you can double click it because I already uh, pre made it to test it. And then um, the Windows Steam version will launch. So it's not the Mac uh, Steam version, but a Windows Steam version. Sometimes I got a question hey, I, I add the serial in my Mac Steam, but it doesn't work. Well, that's obvious because uh, it's a Windows game and that needs in the Windows team. All right, I log into uh, the Windows Steam, which is uh, launched from out the wrapper. That's the Windows uh, environment. It's a fake Windows environment. And then uh, you can uh, go to. Uh, Rich Razor and Bounded. In your case, it won't be there. So, uh, or if you already purchased, it might be there. But uh, most likely, you should uh, click on uh, Add a Game, Activate Product on Steam, and then click on Next. And then after purchase it on uh, Gamesgate, you can paste the serial in here, and then uh, click on Next, and it will activate, and then the game will downloading. And then at the end, it will say uh, here uh, Play. And then uh, you can choose here. I would set if you have a resolution of our MacBook, you should uh, put it to lower than 128800. And if you have an uh, iMac like me, I advise not to put it to the full AD, but it's to 1600 and 900 to yeah the speed to put it uh, well the best, well the best. Still not native Windows, but it yeah it's doable. As you will see in the, the video, the game launches and everything just all fine. It's only the performance, um, well, should is better in uh, in Windows than uh, all right. Uh, it's quite hard at the same too. Well, I find it hard. I'm well. <coughs> I'm crashing all the time. And they say the drifting. Oh, it is so nice. But oh, if you drift, uh, you, well, you're gonna die. They say it's, it's really enjoyable because you can uh, because you can crash through everything almost. Whoa! Ah. 
control you can uh, do the, the spray. Ah, I'm 12 again. Man. Oh! Look like uh, an entrance. Six and Never gonna make it, man. That's what I said. If you crash once, then uh, then uh, it's well, quite unlikely that you will. Uh, So speed isn't really um, the bottom line here. You should, well, because they can easily get. Uh, well, Just make sure you don't bounce to into something, then they should be fine. But it still doesn't mean that it's very easy to play. Well, after playing a couple of times, then. Whoa! Yes, I finished. 12. Wow! Learning your ropes. Well, yes, I want to quit. Well, thank you for watching. Hope to see you back on Paul Telecom. If you love the work you do, you can also donate to my website, become a premium member, and support my hard work. And yeah, uh, spread the word and see you back on Paul Telecom. Bye bye.